in this class we will try to derive the wave equation now this is the first class in plane waves now we know the maxwell equation del cross e is minus db by dt this we have already seen in the previous lecture and even we have proved that now let me take del cross of del cross e or i call it as a triple product so it will be nothing but db by dt of del cross b right so i have to take both the sides now what will be the result of this it will be del of del e minus del square e is equal to minus d by dt of del cross b right let me split this part as we are talking about a vacuum vacuum in the sense there will be no charges you remember del cross e from the maxwell from first equation del cross e is nothing but we know that del dot d is rho v d is written at epsilon right so d will be nothing but epsilon e will be equal to rho v now we are talking about where there is no no source charge so del dot e would be zero in that case so this would be nothing but del dot e we gonna or as we are considering in a vacuum there will be no source charges so there will be no q so del dot e would be zero so we gonna consider this as zero let me omit this so we'll be left with del square e is equal to minus right the minus will go now what is del cross b we already know that del let me write here del cross h is nothing but as per the maxwell equation it is j plus del d by del t right now as we are talking about a vacuum there is no charges j is because of the conduction current it would be also zero so del cross h would be del d by del t this is because we are talking about a vacuum now can i say that del cross h is equal to epsilon naught del e by dt because because d is equal to epsilon naught e and it is in vacuum so i'm assuming as epsilon naught so we also know that b is equal to mu h or mu naught h so if i substitute here can i say that del cross b substituting this over here can i say that it would be mu naught epsilon naught del e by del t right bring that here so del cross e would be d by dt of mu naught epsilon naught d e by dt right so this would be nothing but del square e would be equal to mu naught epsilon naught d square e by d square now let me continue here if i take this over here it would be nothing but d square e by dt square would be 1 by mu naught epsilon naught del square e for information the or i can say kind of a note is 1 by root over mu naught epsilon naught is equal to c we'll see this in the future classes so can i say that 1 by mu not epsilon is equal to c square so this would be d square e by 
dt square would be c square del square e. and what we have proved is nothing but the this is the general equation of a plane wave so we have proved the general plane wave equation from the maxwell equation we'll see more on the upcoming videos